Welcome to the miniatures. Oh, hold on a second. Welcome to the miniatures paintbrush. Today we're going to talk about protection for your breathing. Well, <clears throat> I'm feeling a little better this week. Last week I was pretty sick. Let me tell you something of what happened. Doctors can't really put a place, uh, put a name on what exactly happened, but I can tell you that I've had uh, blisters in my mouth and in my throat, making it significantly hard to breathe, eat, and drink. In fact, the last couple of days, I've been going back to the hospital to get an IV drip so I don't dehydrate. And there are some possible things that had occurred. One thing that I can imagine is that I was mowing the lawn, it was kind of windy, I mowed over some poison ivy or something like that, it kind of went in my mouth. That's no fun. Another possibility is, or it got me thinking of, uh, how dangerous it, is, dangerous it is to use an airbrush and put some of these chemicals in it like to clean it out. When you're blowing, this material, you're essentially taking liquid and atomizing it. You're breaking it down to small, small particles. And these small particles, you can breathe in. And if you can breathe them in, they're toxic. Let me tell you about something that's superiorly toxic to breathe in. Nail polish remover. Uh, also known as acetone. Now, this liquid here is highly dangerous, and if you do not have your parents' permissions, do not touch it. They need to be present while you use it. Discuss with them all the safety concerns about using acetone. You combine acetone, which is dangerous already, with an airbrush that atomizes that stuff to make it breathable, essentially. And you're in a world of hurt. So that mask that you saw me put on, uh, and this is the one I use, it's a 3M. I got this one from Lowe's. You can get it from Amazon. Um, it's not the interior one. It's the exterior construction high grade one. I got it for uh, 30 bucks. Okay. And uh, you may be thinking, well, that's, that's a lot of money. How much is your lungs worth? 30 bucks? I think they're worth a little more than that. The moral of the story is I got hurt. I got hurt and it was terrible for a very long time, running fevers, completely sick. You can prevent that for yourself by using the appropriate protection. So, I hope you found this video helpful. Please be careful and use the correct safety procedures when you doing this hobby. So this way maybe we can play together at one of these conventions. Well, if you liked the video, like, if you want to see more videos, subscribe, and share with others. Get the, get the message out, you know? Use protection. Don't be too big to use protection. Don't, be, don't think it's not cool or anything like that, because really... I have so many Bane jokes right now. Well, I'll catch you next time on the Miniatures Paintbrush.